Hey folks, Ray from LoveYourRV.com. Uh, today I'm going to take you on a little day trip uh, Anne and I did recently up to a very special beach on the west side of Vancouver Island called Botanical Beach. It's about a two hour drive out a windy road out to near Port Renfrew. So let's just zoom in on the beach here and give you an indication of the hike we're going to do. Yeah, so we arrive here at the parking lot and there's a loop trail that goes through the forest um, about uh, 2.5 kilometers, so a little less than two miles. You go down and you walk along the, the coastline here and then back up. So the beach is famous for its tide pools. It's a very unique uh, geological formation. Um, there's a bunch of uh, kind of slanted up, almost looks like slate. And then there's a, a bunch of sandstone, and the sandstone's formed a lot of uh, pools when the tide goes out. So you get a lot of almost like looks like an aquarium when you look inside. And uh, also, I was able to get some pretty cool footage of some harlequin ducks that, <clears throat> that were playing in the surf. So um, we'll take you out there and give you some footage. Enjoy. Okay, after a long windy drive, we've made it all the way out here to Botanical Beach Trailhead. Now we're going to go down and do the loop trail and check it out. Just more of an insert here. So it's a 2.5 kilometer trail. We'll go down and check out the beach. creek down there. A little bit mucky in spots on the trail, but it's pretty wide this one. It's actually a service road of some kind. Looking fungus growing out of this old log. funky looking trees along the coast here <laughs> growing all sorts of which ways there we go it's like botany bay down there go with tantalizing tide pools. Go down and check it out. Only it was about a 10-15 minute walk down from the parking lot. Here we are, give you a little 360 of the place. <clears throat> Tide's still going out. 
and expose more of this area that we can go look at tide pools in. Well, that's quite the tangle of kelp. <laughs> wow. Must be a lot of kelp beds out there. Look at that. Lots of bizarre looking boulders and rocks out here. Just love these stone cliffs, so cool. The trees growing out of them. So back down that way is the entrance to Juan de Fuca Strait. Around the corner down there is when you go into Victoria, Port Angeles. Then all along the mountains and stuff on this side are over in Washington State. Olympic National Park all over there it kind of hooks out to the very end forget what the name is of the point on the very end I'll throw it up in the as some text so I'm still waiting for the tide to get right out expose some of the good uh, tide pools down here A little bit more and I can, should get out onto this rocky area. Just a gorgeous day. Hardly any wind, sunshine. Pretty good for late October. Not very many people around here. It's quite the trek to get out here from Victoria, obviously. Few people exploring. Yes, gorgeous. Check out these reflections. There's Anne playing over there. I taking a bunch of uh, macro photography of little critters and stuff. <laughs> hey, 
any of you guys want to check out Anne's photography, her uh, web address is annemckinnell.com. That's where she posts all her pictures. They usually lag a bit. She's got so many pictures to process, so you might not see these ones for a year or two. <laughs> hey, we're starting to get a few interesting ones exposed. Go down in here. <clears throat> Look in this one, there's a beautiful purple... Uh, I think it's a... Uh, can't remember. Urchin. I think it's an urchin hiding in there. A couple purple ones. And then there's some over here that have a lot of uh, mussels. More out here. That's a beauty, that one. Nice. Here's another beauty. Yes, it gets fed by a lot of fresh water. Salt water, but <clears throat> fresh tide every cycle. See all the life teeming in there? Definitely have to watch the tide tables to make sure you come here. Just as the tide is going out, you want to be here at low tide when they all get exposed. Come here at high tide, you're not going to really see a lot. It's pretty, but you won't see these uh, pools. These ducks are so cool. Surfers.
rock on this side. It's pretty cool. Everything's pretty cool, right? <laughs> it's all been tilted on its side. Yeah, I was wrong before. This is Botany Bay. Found it on our, as we're headed back up the, the trail on the loop. Beautiful little island here with trees on it. Gorgeous. Thanks for watching, folks. Till next time, Ray from loveyourrv.com. Cheers, everyone. <laughs>